We have a load of agatized coral here to cut today, my friends. These are gonna be big giant geodes full of crystals and banded agate. Look at this one here. Still looks like modern coral on the bottom of an ocean or maybe in an aquarium somewhere. Look at that, that's definitely a geode right there. We're gonna pick a few of these to start cutting and get to it. So which ones are you most excited about today, Bree? I am super excited actually about these honeycomb shaped ones. I am too. There's all kinds of them here. Look at those things. We can tell that some of them are very mineralized and most certainly geodes. You also have, where's that big crazy one? That, that thing one. is so heavy. It looks like nothing on the outside, but I guarantee you when we cut it, that's a big hollow chamber I bet it's gonna down in there. Good banding. <laughs> you wanna go first today, Bree? You've been dying to cut these I things. Have been. So you pick, pick three. Let's see. Let's go with this guy. Oh, we're starting good. We're really starting good. Really heavy. Okay. Nicely solidified on the outside. Perfect. I think that's a good I choice. I think that's a good one. Number two. Number two, this clear one. Oh, yeah. And let's go with this little glump oh. right here. Uh, that looks like nothing, but I bet it's good. <laughs> All right, let's get suited up. All right, putting on the rain jacket to keep the spray of the water off. Here's the saw today that we're using. It may not look like it, but this is our brand new blade. We just put it on and it's already getting a little bit of surface rust on there. But this is gonna have a much better cut than the blade that we've been using. We already give it a little test and it's fantastic. So a quick disclaimer, you're gonna see our fingers getting very close to the saw and it might make you a little nervous. One thing to keep in mind is that this thing is not sharp at all and it will not cut us even if we touch it with it running. You can think of it more as a very thin grinder instead of a super sharp saw blade. It just stormed for like an hour. We were actually ready to record this video. We started recording and it came down, my friends. Huge thunderstorm. We had no water in this bucket at all. Now there's several inches here as well as down in there. Get All right, there. where's the one? Where? Oh, there they are. Let's do the unassuming one. All first. right, let's do it. Okay. Almost there. Okay. There it is. Off we go, and the reveal. A little Here geo. The pocket. Just a little one. <laughs> and a bunch of stink. So Bree just trimmed the ends off of that that didn't have any like geode stuff in it. We're gonna check that under a UV light in a little while to see if there's any good banding. But in the meantime, you're gonna move on to the next one, Bree. This one. Oh, that one. All right, let's do it. There we go. Okay. All right, let's check it. What? Excuse me? <laughs> Spray it with water. Nothing. Is it really nothing? I mean, like, it's... What? Solicified, but holy butts, is it I don't ugly. like it. All right, let's see if this is the one, Bree. Your first two, little disappointing. Yeah. But let's see if this is the one. I have hopes. I do too. <laughs> oh, it broke. It broke. Okay. Let's see if it's any good. Oh yeah, that's Ooh. what we're talking about. Let's take it to the hose. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Wash it, wash it. Oh my it. gosh. That's a beautiful one, Bree. Yeah, finally. Look at that. Okay, hose turn off. Oh look my gosh. That. There's actually a huge cavity. Oh my god, look at the color. Yeah. Wow. You really wouldn't expect that something like that on the outside would be beautiful blue and multicolored inside. Brie, you want to take a slice off this thing? I think I do. You do? Let's open it up a little bit better. Okay. There we go. Okay. Let's, let's see. see. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, that was a good choice, Brie. Uh, that was a good choice. Let's wash it. Look at those eyeballs. Yep, take, oh wait, that's the wrong, oh, yeah. that's the wrong setting. That'll squirt the camera and everything. Hold on, <laughs> I'm spinning. No. Not that, there we go. <laughs> uh, okay. Dump it out. Let look me. at that. Whoa, oh, man. Eyeballs. Look at that thing. Okay, let me wash this side up. Yeah, I cut a little slice of that thing was a fantastic idea to open up that chamber a little bit more. 
That is just gorgeous inside, and I know that's going to be beautiful banded under UV. The slice is also very pretty. Oh yeah. That storm is coming. Look at that. That's awesome. I also forgot to mention that we're going to be doing a giveaway, giving away a lot of these coral that we cut today. All you have to do to enter that is make sure to watch the full video to the end and then comment down below which one you'd like to win. We're going to cut this one open right now and this is going to be one of the giveaways. Giveaway number one. All right, let's see. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's a strange one. It has both. That um, that weird look of that one that you cut, Brie, mm -hmm. with a pretty chamber. Nice. Let's hit that with the UV light right now to show what giveaway number one looks like. So here's coral number one under the ultraviolet light. There is a lot of banding showing up on that bottom chamber. Let's move on. And we just wanted to take a quick break to announce to you guys that we have a new product up on the website. These are geopacks, which are gem and mineral dig kits. It's gonna have all kinds of stuff like this in there. Red Jasper, we're gonna have Tiger Eye right there, Lapis, little pieces of geodes like that, and that one full of crystals right there. We're also gonna have calcite crystals found here in Florida. These are gonna glow under UV light as well as phosphoresce. Look at that individual crystal right there. We're gonna have little clusters of calcite crystals like that, as well as these. It's just like what we're cutting today, agatized coral geodes. These will glow all along the edges. These are gonna be in every single one of the packs. You guys know I have to throw some other type of fossil in there like that. So if you take these things and dump the kit in an old colander or something like that, all you gotta do is just spray it out like that. Sift it, and it's ready to go. This is gonna be an excellent thing for like any beginner collectors, maybe anybody that doesn't have a collection yet, or maybe people that wanna make jewelry. Some of this stuff is gonna be great for making jewelry. Look at that little coral geode. We got some sort of thing there. I'm also gonna have an ID uh, section on my website. So anybody who buys these can just ID their finds. Look at that beautiful uh, amethyst right there. It's a roll, uh, tumbled amethyst crystal. I think that's green adventuring right there. And yeah, so if you guys are at all interested in this sort of thing, it will be linked down in the description below as well as the pinned comment. Let's get back to cutting more of these geodes. All right, it's my turn to pick my three. I think I'm gonna start out a little bit slow and I'm gonna choose this one first because it's such a cool classic looking piece of coral. Look at that thing. It also does feel heavy. I think it could be something in there. For number two, this is a strange one. Tiny, thin little flap. I'd like to cut that with a blade right down that direction. So that's two. And then for number three, we're gonna take this one. This thing feels completely solid, but I can see really pretty polyps. So I'm excited to cut that and see what it looks like. So the last time I cut coral, I put on my rain jacket and I forgot to zip it up and I got soaked and then I did it again. I did it two times. This time we're going to zip that thing up. We're going to put on our safety glasses and I'm going to start out with a tiny one right here. All right, there she is. Over to the water. I'm trying not to look yet. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh. Is that Druzy? Oh. Look at that. That's so cool. What in the world? I love that. Look at that. That little cutie cool. had some nice stuff in it. Oh, <laughs> oh he's going to go suck on the flowers. That's right. right. That's so cool to me just because looking at it, it just looks like random coral and it holds a beautiful geologic treasure inside. All right, time for this solid one right here. This is not gonna be a geode inside, but I think it's still gonna be beautiful. All right, we got that solid one cut open and it took quite a while. Let's see 
first peak ever. <gasps> oh, <laughs> look at my that. Gosh. The little polyps are completely oh. solid. The pattern is gorgeous. It is amazing in the color. Oh my gosh. Okay, now the little thin one here. I have no idea what to expect from this one at all. All right, my friends, we got we got that one cut. Now come over here. I saw this piece break off. It looks like this thing oh. is gonna have some stuff inside. Spray it down and do the reveal. Oh, I'm excited. Oh. <laughs> Oh, no oh way! <gasps> oh. Are you kidding me? Holy cow! Look at all the weird red, some other weird mineral formation in there. That is so cool. We have some saw marks, but I'm gonna polish those out. That's this like, one, this one's fantastic. <laughs> That's the best one so far. I can't believe that thing formed in this tiny flat piece of coral. Like you would just never know. <laughs> So there we are so far with what we have cut. Really beautiful stuff for the first batch. And time to do the switcheroo and Brie, you already got your three picked out, I don't you? Do. All right, let's see that one there. Which one's first? Which one are you cutting first? I think I'm gonna go with the longy. Okay. There we go. Okay. That's two, number Batch one for Brie. Rinse it out. No peeking. Okay. okay. I like the sound. Hi! Hey! <laughs> a good one! That's a great one. <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh. This one has some nice little white colored stuff down there in the bottom. But that's a pretty little geode. Good job there, Brie. There's number two for Brie. Pretty unassuming, but we're about to find out. There you go, Brie. Good luck. There we go. Okay. All right. I'm gonna say that didn't look like anything. I feel it. You do? I feel it. Okay, we're gonna find out. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh my gosh, there's still a little in there. Yeah, I'm gonna take this side while yeah. you clean that side. What? Oh my gosh, I have gonna, a good feeling. Yeah, you are totally right. I mean, it just doesn't look like anything on the outside, then it's beautiful. Now, oh. there's some saw blade marks that we're gonna polish out of there, oh, yeah. obviously. This is just step one in the process, but oh what? Gosh. What? Oh, you can even see through it. Look at that. That one's like a whole galaxy. Yeah, I know, look at that. Let's get a good close up. It's like a nebula out there. The big one's next. The big one. Okay. There it is. Oh, oh, I think, did you uh, peek? I think you peeked. Almost. Almost? <laughs> Flip. Okay. okay. Let's see. Is it beautiful? Whoa, it's what is weird. the tube? What's the He's tube? He's got a tube. What the dink? I don't, I don't get it. What is that? Was it maybe like a burrow of some sort? A, like a burrowing clam? I don't know. That's so cool though. That <laughs> one has a lot of little solid areas for potential banding. Yeah. We'll hit that one with the UV light for sure. <laughs> we also wanted to show you guys this piece of coral that we don't even have to cut open from a different location. Look at that druzy quartz. All those beautiful crystals growing inside that hollow pocket. I love the crystal filled ones like that too. Let's go ahead and do giveaway number two here. We're gonna see what this one looks like. There. Oh, there it is. There we go. All right, see there's mud coming out of it. Oops, wrong way. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my look gosh. at that. Look at that. Whoa! That's a good one, my friends. Giveaway number two right there. So there's giveaway number two. If you'd like to win this one, make sure to watch the full video and comment down below. 
If you do win, I am gonna reply to your comment and let you know you won, and I'll send you my contact info so you can send me your address. So this one's a little bit darker under UV, but there's beautiful banding all along the edges. Look at that little eyeball by that finger. I also just wanted to mention that if you guys would be interested in purchasing any of these things, I will have a link down in the description below to my website where I have a bunch listed already polished and everything. Uh, any purchases there will help to support the creation of new videos and adventures that we go on. If you're not interested in purchasing any, that's all right. Stick around because we're going to do a couple more giveaways as soon as <laughs> it gets dark. Hey there, mister. Yeah, this guy here is a, a rescue that just showed up randomly the other day. We got him to the vet, got his vaccinations, got him all treated. He was just covered in fleas. He has a bunch of scabs, but he's on his way to healing up. Right there. if it's any good. Oh, oh, oh yes. my gosh. Yes. Look at oh, that crazy thing. That thing is gorgeous. <laughs> I just realized that I didn't zip my jacket for that round, so I'm wet again. What's wrong with me, okay? Wait, it's it tradition. Go? It is, it's a tradition. This, I'm super happy with this thing. That's a beautiful, oh beautiful thing. Hey, you guys know those uh, like psychological ink blot tests that they do? You guys will have to let me know in the comments below what you think each one of these things looks like. Like, what is this thing right here? Okay, what about if we turn it that way? <laughs> All right, sweet. There's a nasty storm moving in right now, but we're gonna cut as much as we can until it hits. Yep. That's your next one right there, Bree. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. <laughs> Careful, Ling. Careful. Beautiful That's cut. That's like the first time I ever <laughs> did it perfect. Yeah, perfect cool. on the end there. Okay, let me try to rinse it out. I might have accidentally seen a bit when I picked it up. And was it good? I hope so. Let's see. Did my eyes lie to me? Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh my god! Okay, we gotta hold that one up to the light. Oh my god! The color on that is crazy. Oh my god! What? What is that? I like? Don't know. <laughs> All right, my friends, we're hearing thunder. It's getting kind of dark out right now. We're gonna take a bit of a break and come back out here when the storm moves off. <laughs> well, it is uh, really coming down out there right now. Power is going out. <laughs> wow. It would not stop raining last night. We couldn't finish the video yesterday, so we're gonna finish it today when it gets a little bit darker out so we can use a UV light and show you guys all the incredible banding on this coral. But we just wanna take a minute and pause and show you guys why we've been kind of late on making videos. We've been super busy lately. We've been working on stuff like this. Big fields, old neglected farm fields here where we live. We've been clearing it out for a big project that we have in the works. Oh no, these thorns have me, they're everywhere. I have a chainsaw available to me, but this is what makes it fun for me. Super hard work, but I love it. I love knowing we're doing it with old timey tools the way they did it back before they had chainsaws. It's hard work, but it works well. I think uh, I think we'll do a garden right here once we get some of these trees taken out to open up the sunlight. So this is just one small garden of probably four or five this size that we're gonna have out here. Hopefully, oh, well, hopefully, I guess we won't have to water the seeds that we have in here. Hopefully we're gonna be able to produce the, the majority of the food that we eat right here off of this property when we get all this stuff done. We've even been considering kind of clearing this area right here and maybe getting some chickens. I love the idea of actually being able to get eggs and Bree loves the idea of cuddling with chickens. Yeah. So, <laughs> so I don't know about that. Uh, do any of you guys keep chickens? If so, let us know if we should get some chickens for the property here. So it's just been a ton of work lately. We've really been thinking more about self 
sustainability. And on that note, we have several hours before it gets dark. I think we're gonna forage and catch some dinner for tonight. Normally we'd cut the video here and we'd start it back when we start cutting later, but we're just gonna bring you guys along for the whole adventure today. We're about to fill this dish up with nice blackberries growing wild everywhere out here right now. And then we're gonna take our snack and we're gonna go catch even more food. Why? Why? Oh <laughs> I'm getting some berries though. Oh yeah. yeah all right, give yeah. them to me. Uh, I'm just gonna chow down right now. No, <laughs> Look at it staining my finger. Mm -hmm. This brings back memories of being a kid. Oh, I dropped one. Oh. Yeah, this is about all I did in the summer as a kid when it was season is pick blackberries and eat them. <laughs> all right, we got some nice wild foraged fruit. Time for some wild foraged veggies. Yeah. <laughs> So you see this vine here with all these thorns? Way up at here, Bree. let me hand you this. Let's pull this thing down. Look at this, right here. That, Whoa. that's, I'm just gonna break it way down here. Okay. Oh, look at it just dripping water. We're gonna wait till it breaks like, right about there, there it is. That is like a giant asparagus right there, my friends. You cook it up just like asparagus. It's called Smilax. Smilax. Uh, what's another one? Greenbrier, I think? Yeah. There it is. Those are next Smilax. <laughs> <laughs> Those are huge. There, there we go. go. Perfect. Into the pile it goes. Heck yeah. Just gotta test it. Find where it snaps naturally. There we go. Perfect. The tiny little ones are also excellent. You get a lot of these. The bigger ones are a little harder to find. Just gonna pick a bunch here. There we go. Nice. Veggies. Add them to the pile. We got our fruits. We got our veggies. Now it's time for the protein. Oh uh, yeah. All right. Here we go. Here we go. There it is. Oh yeah, yummy. Oh, yeah. I see you slipping. <laughs> it's pretty in here though. <laughs> we're bringing the cooler with us because I know we're gonna catch some stuff up here. Okay, got all the gear. Let's go. <laughs> this whole area was recently underwater, so it's very muddy and wet still. All right, let's sneak over here and toss this in. I don't know how deep it is out there. Hey. Ooh, that's a good fight. Hey. Come on. Dang. Dang. Oh, oh, oh that's a big one. Holy cow. Get him in. Oh, that's a great God. one. Holy cow. Look at that thing. Oh, he's beautiful when they get your hook out. Oh my gosh, that is a literal pan fish. He is the size of the pan. Look at that purple. Wow, he's beautiful. Holy Beautiful. Okay, we need like five more of those and we're good. <laughs> oh, that thing is amazing. Oh, hey. oh sweet. That's Trying to show off my nice fish here and you're just pulling them out. I feel like, uh, <laughs> I feel like you win. <laughs> yeah, let's go put them in the cooler. Okay, in you go, baby. <laughs> Careful. That was a terrible cast. Oh, I'm on the... Oh, I have a fish. <laughs> I thought I was on the stick. He's not bad either. Not either. bad. Oh my hey, god. Hey, that's wow. a good one. Look at that. Ooh, that weird fin on him. Hold on. Where? Oh yeah, it's kind of that all... That is funky. Huh. <laughs> There's a lot of okay. fish off that little tree right there. Go right there. Okay. Get right there. Uh, let's go. Perfect. Let's see. Oh, there he is. <laughs> yeah, and it's Whoa. not bad. Bree, you're the whisperer today. You <laughs> you said, oh, that's an amazing fighter right there. Woo, look at that. Oh my gosh, what a surprise. <laughs> it's like, that's like the one you had. Yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, buddy. Oh, Don't stab me, bro. Goodness. Don't stab me, bro. Holy cow. There we go. 
There we go. Oh. Look at that. All right, into the bucket it goes. Or the, the cooler that we lost the lid for. Oh my gosh, look at them crazy. <laughs> Yeah. I couldn't even get Another my line one. untangled. That's a good one. We are getting so many good keepers. Okay, we have easy dinner at this point. Oh yeah. <laughs> get that big thing. I know, right? Oh! No, you got the big oh. one. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's fighting so good. Holy get him. Cow. Get him my way from oh. the... Oh, that's a oh, whopper. <gasps> Did he <sm> <laughs> Straight in my eyeball. That's a monster. Ooh, she stabbed me. Look at that. That's amazing. <laughs> You're beautiful. Woo. I got him. Oh, got another one. Another great I one. Think, I think you just lost your magic there, Bree. Don't be rude. <laughs> uh, it's okay. I still got the biggest one. You did. It's true. Look at that. That is Excellent. awesome. Yeah, Holy buddy. Holy cow. Put him in, in the cooler. My friend. Thank you. Woo! I just go. Exactly. <laughs> oh! Okay. Oh my gosh, I got one. Oh, okay. Okay. That is crazy. Uh, that is crazy. One after another. That's a red ear sunfish or a shell yeah, cracker there. Yeah. Here you go, baby. You guys will have to let me know if you like watching the fishing stuff that Bree and I do as well. We've never really recorded it, although we're always outside doing this kind of thing. Um, Cause we just didn't know if you guys wanted to see it. It's always been rock hunting and mineral hunting on this channel, but if you guys like this stuff, we'll do a lot more like this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that one right there. Holy cow. That's awesome. That's I'm amazing. That. Okay. Good job. Look at that. I can barely get my hands around him. <laughs> Come on, baby. Come on, let go of that hook. There you go. Nice. Look at that thing. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. <laughs> you happy? Yeah. <laughs> this is so much fun. <laughs> uh, here we go. Oh! Heck yeah, another one! Ha! Dang! Look at that blue. In you go. So Bree is over there on the other side doing some fishing and accidentally casted right on top of a baby gator. I don't know if you can see him right there, his head sticking out of the water. All right, we'll leave your little spot alone now, my friend. It also looks like it's gonna get really stormy, so we might have to head back right now. We made it back to the boat. Had to go through some nasty mud. We really <laughs> didn't wear the right shoes for this stuff today, but we're gonna go back, clean the fish, get ready for dinner, and also cut some more coral as soon as it gets dark. Storm is getting nasty. Well, the storm moved off, but Bree and I had a ton of fun catching dinner for tonight and probably a few other nights because we're going to have leftovers. These are huge, beautiful, well over hand size panfish. So we're going to clean these guys up and uh, get to more cutting. So there they are. We got about three pounds of beautiful boneless fillets of bluegill and other panfish. Well, it got dark out here, but we got dinner here as well as dessert and we got a little fire going here. All right, I'm about to dig in. All right, Smilax time. Let's see. <laughs> How is it? It's so good. Is it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'd say it has like the, the texture of an asparagus with like a, a nutty flavor to it. Mm. 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 <laughs> that is some delicious fish right there. Even better around a fire with smoke in my face. <laughs> 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 the moon is coming up right now and looks beautiful. There was actually an eclipse last night that we got some photos of, so if you guys missed it, this is what it looked like. We're gonna start out the nighttime cutting with giveaway number three. This is a small one, but I think it's gonna be really nice inside. All right, 
We might not need to rinse it. it might be good. Whoa! <laughs> That's a cool oh. little one there. Let's see that UV banding. I think it's gonna be good. All right, lamp. And, oh. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. I like it a lot. Holy cow. So this is giveaway number three, my friends. So oh, comment below wow. if you'd like it. <laughs> so all this stuff we cut earlier, we're gonna hit with this light now that it's dark to see. Oh <laughs> yeah, here Brie, you wanna hold this flashlight? Sure. All right, look at um, that one. Let's move on over this way. <laughs> that's cool. It is really interesting <laughs> on that one. This little guy. Yeah. Nice. Ooh, those that slice is really so nice. So vibrant. Oh yeah. Oh, that that's that's is a amazing. killer. The Holy the bugs crap. sure like that uh, light. <laughs> oh. What the yeah. heck? <laughs> that one right there, oh. I think, is my favorite one that I've cut all day. Oh yes. That's amazing. What about these? That layer that's right so there is weird. so dark. What about the one with the pretty little polyps? Nothing. Really Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well that's pretty cool. Good stuff. That one's the winner out of those. Well, at least that one, and I think that one. That's my favorite one. Yeah. All right, we decided we're gonna go down to cutting two each. For my two, I'm gonna do this longer one here, and this little one, which seems pretty solid. There it is. Now let's see. Oh, it's a really solid Whoa. one. Really pretty. I like it. Let's check it under the UV okay, light real quick. Turn this light up. All right. Oh, oh that's, my God. That's a winner. That is a winner. That's insane. Look at that. All right, next one. There it is. Oh. oh my god. Oh, that's a really cool one. Oh, it's so pretty. All right, let's cut this thing and check it. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> wow. Okay, both the ones I cut are pretty crazy. That's incredible. I'm very happy with the two that I cut. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's awesome. Bree has decided on her two. The giant beast here, and this little guy. <laughs> He'll go first. I'm interested to see that big one. Me too. <laughs> All right, the little one first. Ready? <laughs> I'm ready. Oh, oh a oh clear my one. Gosh. All right, UV time. Oh Ooh, my gosh. Yeah, man. <laughs> Not too bad at all, Brie. Good first choice. Heck yeah. It's time for the beast. Yes. All right, Brie, you decided how to cut this, huh? Yeah. What are you going to do here? Um, Probably start in this corner. Uh huh. Come all the way across this meaty section and come out this other corner. Uh, I think that's your best <laughs> bet there. It's yep. time. Do it. Wow. Let's okay. see. The moment of truth. Okay. The reveal. Oh, oh complete oh. dud. No. no, the beast has <laughs> failed us. <laughs> All right, Bree, pick another one. You get to do three. It's <laughs> that that didn't count. We'll pretend that never happened. Bree has decided to cut this beast right here. The chicken. The chicken foot. <laughs> Most classic looking piece of coral ever. We're going to see if it's another dud or if it's incredible. Yes. Okay. All right, let's go. Here, I'll do the water this time. Yes. It sounds good. Sounds real good. Let's see. Whoa, look at 
Look at the bubbles in there. That's so cool. Can I see the big oh, piece oh. here? Look, there's a whole chamber. Oh, yeah. Look oh at that. Can you guys believe that? That was a coral. <laughs> and now it looks like that inside. Hey, that's redemption for your last one there, oh, Bree. Yes, All right, it let's is. see. Oh, yeah. Oh. Why am I shaking? Because <laughs> it's beautiful. Look that's at right. that. That's amazing. Wow. I love that <laughs> coral. Me too. I like even I even like that it still has one piece that we couldn't get through with the blade because it still shows that it is indeed coral. <laughs> That's awesome. Good job, yeah. Bree. <laughs> well, my friends, it's getting kind of laid out, but Bree is going to cut the final giveaway here. This is going to be giveaway number four. Yep. All right, Bree, do it. Yeah, there we go. All right. Okay. Let's see. Let's see if giveaway number four is gonna be a good one or not. Oh! oh. We're cutting another one. Okay. <laughs> All right. So this is gonna be the real giveaway number four. Here, here you go, Bree. <laughs> there it is. Okay. All right. Let's see. Oh, oh my gosh. Interesting. Let's see that's here. So cool. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's um That is crazy. Let me get close. Let me zoom in good. Look at that stuff. What? Real the interesting. Heck? Beautiful. Yeah, that's a good one. If you guys are interested in this one, that is giveaway number 4, my friends, right there. All right, here are the giveaways once again. We have Giveaway number one, number two there, three is this little one, and then we have number four, and under the UV light, here again is number one, and number two, three, I think three is the winner so far under that UV, and then four, uh, that one might beat it right there. So if you guys are interested in those, just let me know the number down in the comments below. I think that about wraps up this video today, my friends. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. We had a ton of fun doing the fishing and the foraging, as well as cutting open these corals. Speaking of the corals, if you do want to pick up a geo pack that has corals like this in it, there'll be a link down in the description below. We'll also have these cut and polished corals listed on my website if you're interested. Thank you guys again so much for hanging out with us today, and we'll see you in the next video.